everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more anime warfare with me and la, 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 la. some mods have been updated. There's a thing to say first. I don't know why I always have to feel I need. I feel I need to need to say something right to the very well. I'm doing a video. It makes sense. I have to make say something. But I feel like I have to say some bits of news or something right to the start or something. And I've got into this routine of doing this of what's changed, what's different, what's going on. Da, 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 da. Can't just get straight into things anymore, can we? No, no, no. I've got to go about all the new things. Which, yeah, in this case, the, two, the mods have updated. Ruby mods updated a bunch. Uh, cause yeah, the the raid crystal things were broke. They're fixed. And um, the mal mod updated. No idea what it did, but it updated. So I put it, I put the updated version in. News. Um, I'm not really doing much so much on this server, but on the Ruby server, doing lots of bits. Have noticed though, this village, it's, it's changed ever so slightly. They put fences in between buildings, which is what I did in the Ruby server to stop people from walking between them and stopping monsters getting in between them. That's interesting. But right. Um. Anyway, let's go over who got waitlisted first. Then let's decide what we're going to be doing today because we know we need to bit the village to do some bits and pieces, among other things. So right. Whitelist! One new person is added from the comment section to the whitelist. That person has underscore zero underscore drag Neil. You've been white uh, underscore. You've been whitelisted. Mod pack appear we're not linked to the well, the three mods that aren't inside the mod pack. Ribby, Mao mods, or the fate mod. Plus uh Death Note. Are there. Might possibly there's another mod I'm tempted to add in. Tempted, and I don't. Uh, we'll, we'll see about that one come in the future because might be reviewing it, might not. We'll soon see. It depends how I think of it later on. But right, anyway, the village, the village. I've been kind of hands off with this mainly because pugs took over production, construction, and everything. And I just sort of took the back seat at that point because I'm not very good at building. So, you know, figured it was probably for the best. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's in tatters right now. <laughs> It's in tatters. Obviously, it's not exactly Pug's fault for that, but, you know, it's it's a bit in tatters. This has exploded. Oh, my. Um, It's the bit of tatters right now, because it seems that the chain of production and everything just kind of fell apart. Uh, there's numerous reasons why this could be, because uh, things could get killed by monsters. Things could certainly get killed by, say, exploding creeps. Creeps were a bit, have a bit, they were a bit glitched before. Like, that building there has clearly had a bomb thing gone through it. Yeah, that could have easily been a creep. Uh, creeps were doing this thing where they were exploding with the force of a TNT rather than a creeper. And because of that, they were blowing up terrain even when mob griefing's off. But then again, mob griefing's off in the server anyway, so it doesn't even matter. But yeah, this is more than likely a creep. And when the roof and stuff gets moved off a building, it no longer counts as a building. And plus, they're very good at blowing off these things as well. I've experienced it a few times on the Ruby server. So, that's the thing. Pugs also was saying that things keep, like... Some of these sign bits keep disappearing. I don't know. That possibly just could be creeps keep blowing them up and stuff. Or, like, something's blowing them up and then people are obviously aren't replacing them. I don't quite fully understand how the Tectopia mod works in terms of, like, things. It seems to be the more the more things you get for a village, the more it costs to keep getting more. Which makes sense, you know, because if you want to keep getting more of the same buildings, it's going to cost more and more and more to do it. And to build up higher, you need to get more and more resources. Because it's expected that... As you build your things up, you'll get more resources. Like, 23 blocks for another tavern, that's insane. But it's expected at this point that you're getting that many resources in because you've bought that many mines, you've bought that many farms and that, that you're going to have the stuff to do trades. And then you're going to build the Galar Emeralds that way and stuff. That's what's expected. Not quite what's happening because things, again, have fell apart. So that's that's quite unfortunate. There's 12 Emeralds in there. I'll be taking those for a minute. Um, Right. As I see it right now... We have too many mouse to feed, and not enough food to ground. There's, there's clearly, I think there are still farmers alive, but there's not very many. And said farmers, they're doing their best, but it's not working out for them. The chef might be dead, the butchers seem to be long gone, the butchers seem to have glitched out for a while, and it seems like they've just never came back. There are a lot of houses in this village, possibly too many houses, or possibly just the right number, I don't know. It's, it's kind of hard to tell, really. Either way, though, I'm under the impression that we've just we've bought that many houses and stuff that it's sort of tallied up the price of everything else. So that's quite unfortunate at the end of the day because everything's really, really expensive. And people have bought things to give villagers jobs and that, and then God knows what's happened to those villagers. But no, I think I think we're at a point now where we've got too many. Look at all these people. Look at all these people in green. These people in green, they've not got jobs. They're unemployed. And they're dumb. And... 
they've got no good future ahead of them. So, what I'm thinking is, we might want to do a bit of a purge. Badoosh. Um, yeah, I think I need to kill some of these people. I don't want to be the bad guy in here, but it's one of those situations where these unemployed people are eating food. Honestly, they're not. There's no real point to their existence. Now, these are the people that have jobs. I'm not killing any of the people that have jobs. This guy here, here's the butcher. He's alive, actually. Uh, but unfortunately, there's no, I guess there's no rancher. The rancher's not around. Also, they're all really unhappy. They're all miserable. Probably because they've got very little food. Who knows? All I know is I'm going to purge a lot of people, aka the unemployed. And we're going to see how that has an effect. We're going to see that has a knock-on effect in the village. We're going to try and get this village back in order a little bit. Which is going to be very, very hard for me. Because I do not have the funds to do this. But we'll have a look see about it and see what we can do. I'm going to, just, going to do my best to try and help. Fit. I'm going to try and do my bit. As the Grim Reaper it's going to come in and kill the unemployed. Right, um, so alright, let's go find some unemployed poor sods that, well, pretty much they've just, they've had a bad hand in life. We're going to end the suffering. At least that's the goal. Now, there's a lot of houses in this place. I've got a lot of houses to visit. It's like Santa Claus, only I'm not delivering presents. Um, but though, also curiosity, right? Blacksmiths and stuff. If you've got a bed in here, would the blacksmith stay here? That's the thought I've been having. Also, look how many empty beds there are. Where are they all? Do they even have guards? I haven't seen any of it. Right, this place is empty, that's fine. Alright, um, go over here a second. This is the barracks. This is where the guards are supposed to go. This is where the captain was for a while. There's beds here where I assume the guards are meant to sleep because apparently these don't count as things. The, the, none of them are took though. See, the guards aren't living here. They're just ignoring this place's existence or all the guards are dead. I don't know which one it is. I don't know, how, I don't know if there's a way to check how many people are in a village to be honest. Hello! There's a chef alive! You're alive! And so are you! You're a farmer, you're alive! Alright, we've got one chef, one farmer accounted for in this two bedroom house here. Um, oh, there's so many places to visit, so many places to visit, so many things to stop. Uh, right, yeah, you're a miner now. The miners have got a bit of a situation going on. The mines have run up dry. They're, there's, the, the mines are kind of broke right now. Uh, you basically when it comes to the mines, you're supposed to like change the thing for them every now and then. They've run out of space, they've not been changed recently, so they're sort of buggered. So we need to go and have a wee seeing to that. There's some more two bedroom houses. Another butcher! Hello! This one's set to not butcher animals. Well, these cl Wait, hold on. Have some of the villagers been set to just not do their job? Is that what's happening here? Possibly. Need to have a look at that. The hell is this? What's this? It's a box. Right, we're just gonna ignore it. Uh, da, 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 da. Has pet, don't kill. Well, <laughs> it's not around anymore. Half shack. Oh, it's a door. I see. That makes more sense. Right, um. Where are all these people gone? Oh, there's more houses over here. Hello! You're a farmer. You're unemployed! I know it. Look at him. Look at this lazy unemployed just lying there. Look at them. Look at them all. I would say I'm sorry, but I'm really not. To be fair, to be fair, I'm killing them off because we need the food. Alright? Once the food situation is sorted out, I've got all these hearts to replace them. They're unemployed. They're not important. They didn't cost, they haven't, nobody's invested any time or effort into them. The teacher appears to be dead as well. And I don't see a library in this place. That's the situation. Is there meant to be a library? Was there once a library? I'm not sure. There's an unemployed again. Oh, I see. Oh, there's two of them. Ah. Oh. visit the tavern. Maybe, are you set to do your job? Yeah, okay. You're set to do your job. Where are you coming from? Where are you? Oh, the mines. They're coming from the mines. Is that a, is Yes, that's a village carrot. All right, put the village carrot in the village stuff. Cool. What's that? You're hungry. We'll stop eating all the food. Eating all the food. You're not putting anything into the village. Look at y'all. They're all hiding in the mines. That's where they were. They're all underground. Die. No, no. You lot are fine. You lot are fine. There's a lot of blacks. Blacksmiths. There's a lot of... Uh, there's another chef. Nobs. Uh, there seems to be a lot of thingies. Which am I call it? Ah, what's the name? What's the word? 
What's the word? Miners, that's the word. There seems to be a lot of miners floating around. That's interesting. Yeah, see, so these are all deactivated. They're not working here, so I guess we make some over here now. Forgot powerful for this pickaxes. Um But No, just go one in. We want to leave the rest for the miners to do. Perfect set, this pickaxe is too powerful. How is, it, how is it so powerful here? I don't know. Right. Toss the eye. I've got no inventory space. Let's see if I can fix this. I mean, it might seem a bit cruel what I'm doing. I mean, I'm, I'm straight up murdering the, uh, the the unemployed, but you know. <laughs> it might seem a little, a little unfair. It, it is unfair. You're not really meant to kill the unemployed. But to be fair, it is a solution. It's not, you know, necessarily the best solution, but this isn't exactly, you know, a civilized world we're in right now. This is a... Very uncivilized world, we'll say. So that's the thing, right? Put that lot there. Pop that there. Active. No. Pop that there. Active. Pop that there. Active. 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 We still have two more. Where the feck am I putting those? We really need space. Ow. There we go. Bust these down. Eventually, what's going to have to happen is. They Something I've learned from Andrew B. Uh, right now, these mines are like right down on essentially diamond level, which you think means they're more likely to find diamonds. Maybe they are. I have no idea. Uh, but apparently, it's, it's kind of random what they find. Like, it's not affected by the level they're on. So, possibly after this lot's done, maybe we should put on our floor and move them up a level. Or down a level. I don't know. Move them down at a different level so that we can just use all the space again. That probably is the best thing. Oh, he's so sad. Oh, yeah, the druids and stuff. They're all dead. The druids. The the clerics, the entertainer who's an absolute fortune to replace, but he's, he's long gone. Where are you? You're a blacksmith. What are you doing? What are you down here for? Feck knows. There's a chef. Is the chef's kitchen open? There's a farmer. Are you, are you doing your job? Or... Oh, you're set too. You're just really unmotivated and unhappy. Right, the butchers is here. It's still active. I also don't know where, like, just about anything in this place is. So, <laughs> I keep getting lost looking for things. Oh, it's glorious. Right, that's... That's nothing. <gasps> Merchant! Oh, ow! What would you like? Potatoes, you would like. Beetroot. Iron pants. Breads. Alright, cool. Iron helmet. Redstone! Ooh, I've got lots of that. One one wee tick, mate. Mate, if you got if you got to step inside the building that constructed for you to step inside, that would be fan bloody fantastic. But, yep. Okay, let's just throw, throw, grab all the redstone. These are these are not these are not village potatoes. All right, toss that in there. Right. Hello. Would you like to trade? Oh, I would like to trade very much, sir. Yeah, give me all the emeralds. I'm going to need them. <laughs> what do you mean there? Don't near me. No. Mate, all I've got is redstone. Don't do this. All right, bread and potatoes, maybe. I don't think there's any potatoes. I'm pretty sure they've been eaten. Yeah, they're all there. They're ones constructed by us. The bread's all made by us. Or it's made with, I don't bloody know. Eggs, we've got lots of. Fellows we've not will we've got lots of seeds we've got lots of more eggs sugar cane more hearts sweet Yep, yeah, okay we got nothing else Unless he wants to trade in wood but I'm pretty sure he doesn't so I got eight emeralds I got ten emeralds off and that's alright something Alright something I suppose Yeah there's nothing else to trade damn it There's not a merchant here mate you wanna step inside you are you're pretty bad at this mate like this is specifically designed for you to chill inside but instead you just you just hang out at it which is quite odd because these things, normally they only work if they're placed beside doors. If they're not placed beside doors, they don't tend to bother. It's very odd. Right. I still haven't seen a chef's place anywhere. I don't know where, I don't think, if the, I don't know if I see a teacher anywhere. Or a cleric or a druid or anything like that. Anything to raise people's spirits. Doesn't seem to be any of those. Glorious. There are pens, but all the animals are dead. Might have been the butchers doing. Um, wish there was a way to gather all the people. 
Oh yeah, and the chicken coops. That empty completely. Well, it's empty, but like, yeah, they're all gone. Right, we could recoup the chickens. We could get the chickens going again. Because there's a million eggs through there. As long as the butcher doesn't butcher them again. Where is the butcher? We've got chefs. Cool. But there's no kitchen. I don't see a kitchen anywhere. Butcher! Mate, hello. Yeah, you're not doing anything. Leading library. I don't see a library either. Do we have these buildings? Is that a thing we have somewhere? <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I've not seen any anywhere. You have a different merchant. Yeah. I don't recall ever seeing one of those. Ever. In this village. I have to do a bit of re... Oh, there is a there is a thing. There is a thing. There we are. That's in a library, though. Unless it's somewhere I've just not visited. But yeah, okay, so the, the cook's supposed to be here. Cook's supposed to be over here. Um, I believe everything out here tends to belong to the players. Whatever this thing is. What's this? Well, clearly a chocobo lives here. All right, cool. Whose house is this? Not a clue. Where are you? You're a blacksmith. You have nothing to do. Craft bucket, craft. Don't craft diamond stuff, alright? Just don't bother with that. Don't bother with that. Uh, do craft iron things, though. Craft all the iron things, because we need iron. There you are. Go do all those things. Do it, do your job. There you are. Ah, right. Uh, <laughs> trying to get things in order here. Yeah, so they're still set to do the thing they're meant to do. I see no guards as well. All the guards must be dead. All the guards must be dead. You're one butcher. But yeah, he's turned to not cook things. No, cook all those things. Cook all those things. Apart from the gold, don't bother the golden apple and gun carrot. Don't, don't bother with them. Go do all those things, though. Go on. What's this place? What's a house? This is a house. So, so everyone's got back doors. It confuses me. <laughs> There's so many houses around here. I've definitely missed buildings. I just not know what they are. Like, I probably have went past the library at this point. But I'm pretty sure I've went through every building at this point. I just haven't found it. Like, yeah, yeah, this is the thing. Right, I think I've purged all the unemployed, though. Which is the main thing. You there! Yes, good. You're maybe doing your job. But you're not quite doing it. Um... No. Recoup the chickens. We could recoup the chickens. There's no rancher though, so they'll just die again. They'll starve because the rancher didn't appear to feed them. So things right now. We need, a, we need basically a bunch of basic things. The only problem is if... Alright, I've killed a lot of people. Since I've killed a lot of people. Will the prices go down? He died. Okay. Uh, right, yeah. You're, you still cost a four. That's fine. There he is. Um, <laughs> that was weird. No, they still cost 13 odds. So even though the all, a bunch of people have died, it still costs a fortune to get more ones. So rancher costs 18. I don't care about the cap too. I, I might care about a black a guard. There's no guards. That's a problem. Guards cost 23. We've not got lumberjacks anymore either, I don't think. We've got tons of miners. Arguably too many miners. Dreads cost 55, Jesus. And chat, I don't even know what they do. Uh, kill it. Cleric, I'm pretty sure what they do. They make, they make, they, like, heal people, I think. But also, like, they raise their abilities. To make them better at their job, I think. Then, yeah, the butcher. Where's the teacher? There he is. 36. Oh, right. <sighs> What do we want to be doing? Alright, there's everyone! Everyone's gathered, I think. This is everyone. It's not quite everyone. This is a lot of folk, though. So you're set to do your job. Yeah, you're set to do things. Again! Set to not cook things. Very odd. Set to cook all these meats and that, but there were no meats. No wonder the village fell apart. They sent them not to cook potatoes. And that, potatoes and that are literally the only thing that was getting made in the village. So everyone's running about with uncooked potatoes and everyone's getting miserable because of it. There is a teacher. No, you're not. 
You're a butcher? Oh, you are. From this angle. I thought for a minute you were a teacher. I thought you were wearing a suit there for a second. <laughs> All right, so craft leather. Yeah, you know what? Go craft leather. That's fine. Just don't butcher any animals. Don't butcher any animals. That's a terrible idea. All right. Uh, yeah, don't craft any stuff like that. You're set to harvest things. You're set to cook things. Yep, everyone's flowing in. Brilliant. Everyone's flowing in. So as it stands right now, I count, what, one, two, three, four farmers? Three farmers I count right now. Oh, no, there's the fourth. You okay? Oh, no. Can you make it? There we go. Those four farmers. It's just literally everyone. <laughs> Those four farmers. There's a butcher. There's two cooks. I count four miners. Yeah, two cooks, four miners, a butcher. Argue we don't need that many cooks when there's, you know, no foods, but... Uh. Right, well, this is an absolute disaster then. <laughs> This is all that's left. They're all dead. They're all just in having a drink together. Like, yeah, I remember we had lots of people and it was a functioning village. Yeah, it was great times back then, wasn't it? Oh, I feel bad for them, man. I feel bad. There's a blacksmith there as well. Right, so we don't need that. We do need so many other things. I, my current funding is 47 emeralds. <laughs> oh, I have to go nip into some people's houses at this shrine and go and hunt for more. Oh... That would find dragon nest, that would work too. What's the odds to be finding a dragon's nest though, like They're not great. They're not they're not great, I will admit, they're not great. Um what can I afford with my current funding? Forty seven emeralds to play with. No, we know a teacher would be important. I forgot a teacher. It's not the most important thing. I think a rancher. So at least get animals and they can start working again. That is important. And a guard. We need at least a guard to kill zombies. Like, give the guard some armor. And shipping. We also don't have any lumberjacks to gather wood. But again, there's lots of wood, so that shouldn't matter right now. I think that's a low priority thing. Yes, tons of wood. We're not going to run out of wood anytime soon. God. There is tons of wheat and stuff there. They could craft things, they could craft bread. And stuff if they wanted. There, oh there. Right, I'm gonna quickly go sleep and pass through the night then. Oh. Really just in tatters. To be fair, I think a lot of it can then. I'm pretty sure someone killed a lot of the villagers. And that screwed the place over quite a bit because obviously villagers were getting killed. Um, I don't know why people did that because it's pretty. It's a pretty screwed up move. I don't know why you bothered. Yeah, someone came in and mass killed all of the important people that we needed. I do think the village... Honestly, at this point, it is probably better just to start a new village. Like... It is probably better to start a new village and just use this village to just trade what's left and let it function... Barely functioning. Because, at this point, it's going to cost so much to buy those new people. Whereas, if you just set up a brand new village... It won't cost all that much. <laughs> By comparison, you can buy the value those basic people again with the money we've gathered from this village. The then it's throwing away all pugs work. Yeah. Feel bad for doing that. Feel bad for him, it's not gonna stop me. Uh right, hold on. How's it cost to make a new village again? <laughs> I'm literally going to go scout a new location, screw it, because at this point Yeah, it's just this village is sort of screwed. This village is sort of screwed. Right, so, yeah, we need... Not the storage. No, we do need the storage. Storage isn't where we start? What? No, yeah, here is where we start. Diamond plus some iron tills. Well, get two of those. Smite as well. Also, for some reason... Yeah, that's separated for some reason. Why is that separated? That's quite odd. We're gonna go pick a new location, I think. We're gonna pick a new location to start again. Might as well. But <laughs> Might as well. Um, blah, 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 blah. So we get time. We get more resources. Well, someone's get more resources. I don't. I don't get that many. Oh, and I have been thinking like some mods I've been using, like mods from the Ruby mod, 
pack. That's a bit tempting. It's a bit tempting to add some of those in. Pickaxe. Wait. I made an axe. Axe was needed. Pickaxe. Ah, it's a shovel that's not needed. There we go. I was like, I know one of the tools isn't required. Which one is it? It was the shovel. Pop, 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 pop. There we are. Make ourselves one of those. I've got an item for it. Hold on. Give me. There we are. I've got a few item frames now. Um, right, that'll do. These are the type of funds you could go in to start a new village with. I think. Well, let's say it is. I toss that in there. Oh, I've got so much junk here. I say junk. It's actually technically good stuff. Right, hold on. Let's go find a new spot. Or right, well. Scouting around the map. See what's a good a good place to start is off. So, right. This is currently the village. It's in shambles. But due to financial situations, we're better off starting a fresh one. To be fair, hold on. Technically, you could just remove the signs from this one to start a new... Ah, uh, that'll work. Then again, see if you're rebuilding the place. Then again, you could build the next one smaller. You could build the next one a bit smaller. Or, yeah, just keep this one running to build funds for the new one. That could work too. Also, preferably if you don't put one right in the middle of a horrible, horrible biome, like, say, there's no biome, then there won't be as many horrible things floating around. That's a thought too. Um, plus, we can still actually technically live here. We can create like a rail cart thing over to the new one. There's the thought. Right. Um, there's no good spots where I live though. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to go this way. I'm going to go see what's over this way. I don't see anything right now. So let's have a gander. What the hell is this? Someone's up a house here. Got destroyed by a dragon. Oh my god, I think someone's up a house here. House here actually got destroyed by a dragon. Let me in, yes, sod. This looks like a village house. It's clearly not a village house. Maybe a village house there. What the hell? Oh, it's, oh, it's, a, it's a grim. Never mind. It's a grim. But yeah, certain mods in um, blah, 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 blah. in the Ruby mod pack, like the, the Disenchanter, that's a really handy mod. Uh, because, well, it, it just means you can disenchant bits of armor stuff. That's a really good mod, especially if you want to try and get mending on things. That's quite good. Plus, you still have to use your levels to, like, you know, put the stuff together and that. And you have to get the enchanted stuff, which gives purpose to the uh, boss mod. That's quite a good mod that might be worth having in this. Um, Twilight Forest. Yeah, that's... I was thinking about that one. That would make life easier for everyone. Getting air modes. And again, there's that many people in the server. It's probably a terrible idea doing that. Like, that would just be chaotic, wouldn't it? Probably. Uh, probably. Wait, hold on. I'm saying... Uh-oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna fall in a second. Uh, where is my glider? There it is. Up and go. Aye, so, um... Thingy magic. It's my jetpack at this point. Yeah, Twilight Forest might not be a good idea. This in chat might be. That's what I was thinking. May watch this fun too. I know, I just think you're rejigging up the pack a bit. Because we changed some of the mods a bit anyway. Plus, I've got an hour mod that I've got my eye on that's not in the Ruby pack. But it could make sense here, sort of. Arr. We'll see. I might, I might redo some of the mods in the mod pick. Obviously, some of the links will still be separate, but you know, it's just. Might change some things. Oh, so, right. Okay, we don't want to build a village where there's already a ruined city. That's a terrible idea. That said, though, this is an island with a city on it. <laughs> those are handy for a completely different reason, aren't they? We could use those for a bit of combat. Yeah, I'm going to mark this. I'm going to mark this. Du -du -du. Island. We decided to do a return amid. Where else? Could potentially use this location. Don't see why not. Right. So I can launch myself. I'm trying to think about that one. I'm very sure there is a way I could technically launch myself. I think it's using the staff. I can launch myself into the air or something. Like, I need to kind of dive into it, though. I'm using mana this entire time. There we go! I did it! 
<laughs> Get me back hate that way. Um, hmm. I could fight. Actually, I'm going to fight with that. Hold the bus. I'm saying I could fight with that. I'm going to fight. I'm going to let my aura return to me. I'm going to go fight with that. I'm going to go fight with that big snake there. Because I've got a spatial staff and I think I could launch that out of the water. And I think it would be a laugh. So I might as well. Um, do I have anything in here I want to use specifically? I've got a teleport thingy. No, I think my rape here would be just fine. I mean, that or freeze it. Freeze the fish! Right, so what I want to do... Probably get onto dry land. Because if I try and target this thing outside of land, it would be a very bad idea. I want to target it with my spatial staff to get it out of the water. Then stab it a load. That's, that's pretty much the plan. Do, 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 do. Let's have a wee gander. There you are. Hello! But... No, that didn't work very well. Doesn't matter, though. It's very vulnerable, as it turns out. Oh. Oops. Okay, to be honest, I was thinking possibly might want to launch it out of the water, then stab it loads. Didn't need to. But never mind. Uh, I thought it was going to be a wee tad harder. It wasn't. Oh. Is there any reason why I want this stuff? The trident's crap. I remember that. I don't care about those. Oh, yeah, the, the armor that she breathed underwater, though. Handyish, I suppose. Right, anyway. Special stuff. Launch me. Whee! There we go. Gets me a free ride up in the air before I use my semblance to move around more. Oh, there's a savannah biome over there. Would that be a good place to live? Maybe? I mean, there are threats there, but... I'm saying, this is all islands. This isn't gonna work. Also, looks like a meteor hit that. What the hell? Looks amazing. Obviously not to live in, but, you know, it looks amazing. A giant chunk of the city just get to a kill. It's like Bobzilla just thrashed through. Also, I saw a chest in here. Hello! Or not. Wait, what? What? I saw a chat. Hello. Yeah, we're not going to bother with that. We're not going to bother with that. This is all islands. No. Damn it. Why did I go out to sea? It was a terrible idea, really. Oh, no, this could work. No, it couldn't. It's too small. Oh, no, it could work. This could work. This could work. Having by the sea? I mean, okay, if a sea monster gets in, we're pretty screwed, but... We put barriers up or something. By the sea, you're not gonna get grim from there, really. The Savannah biome is an alright biome; it doesn't rain, so the villagers shouldn't be as miserable. Aye, this could do. Plus, we could just technically convert over a little bit. So this city here is pretty much destroyed. So break it down, rebuild it, reshape it, rejiggle it as you want it. But mainly, they could just use this space down here to start us off. Yeah, screw it. I'm working here. Right. I'm going to quickly start up a starter building again. <laughs> because that just seems like the smart thing to do. And I guess City 2.0 is going to be here because, well, our Village 2.0 is going to be here. This is hopefully going to be the one that actually works. Because <laughs> the other one was working, then sort of fell apart. Because, I mean, it's so large, but I still don't see certain things like libraries that in it. I don't maybe there was and they just get knocked off or someone took it for a pointless reason. I don't know, but anyway, I'm gonna quickly make a quick building. So what I'm gonna do a quick cut for that because nobody wants to watch me build. I'm not very good at it. So one second. Alright, so just I popped back to the first village. I thought we dealt with the nitwits. You know, or the or the, the well they're called nitwit. Um I thought I dealt with them all. More have appeared. I don't know why. More have just appeared. It's very odd. They're still miserable. Um, I didn't realize they could reappear, but they have. It's, yeah, very odd. Also, bit of thing. So I was saying about that island. Possibly a good idea. It's technically building a village that wouldn't be a terrible idea because by the ocean. Blah, 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 blah. Then I just remembered when you want to get new people into the village in the beginning and you want to get the merchant, you need to have corners to the village, and the corners of the village over there would be the ocean. So, actually, I have to say that's probably a terrible idea, because then the merchant that can't get there. 
Because if they try to, they'll be in the ocean. It means they'll probably also get killed by giant fish. So I think I'm going to go for a different spot that I've noticed up north because... Yeah, trying to make it next to the water there. I, I, yeah, I've just... It's clicked on me. It's a terrible idea. Unless you can have the um, the village in the center and have waters just at the outskirts, like in certain directions, that could be fine. But the corners need to have land, pretty much. I think. I don't know for certain. I think it, if it works like that, then that would be a terrible idea. Like this sort of place. This is the place I was thinking of, I think. It is it. Where is this? Where am I? I'm here. Yes, this is the spot I was thinking of. Yeah, if I built around here. Well, you know, a village will be well around this area. Thus, there'll be trees nearby for stuff. There'll be mountains around us, sure. There's rivers surrounding us, so things have a harder time getting over. Some type of weird well thing here, cool. Um, yeah, I don't know, it just seems like a better spot. There's technically a glacier, but we're not gonna ignore that. Hello! There's also a plains biome. Which is, eh, it's there. So right, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this the location. I'm going to quickly set up shop. Round about here's, I suppose. So yeah, one second I'll set this up and we'll start at village 2.0 and we'll see how this goes. There we are. So, just three quick houses you shoved up, because it's pretty much all we need. Quick wee farm put together. Possibly need to add carrots to it, but yeah. Got some potatoes, got some wheat, grab some resources from the other village. Huzzah! Let's give this a go and see if we can set this up and see if it works. So, right. Pop that there. Town hall. Hoping this just counts as a new thing, and thus it doesn't, like, you know... Add on to that one and think, oh, it's going to cost you a fortune to build here as well because. There we go. Hopefully, this tall counts as fresh and new. Now we get that stuff, that's good. Um, And yes, everything is cheap here. Oh, thank God. Yes, everything is cheap here. Good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Right, so in that case. Yeah, mate, you do, you do that. Um, can now shove a thingy here. And make this storage. Oh, yeah, we need beds. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Grab some wood from another place. One, two. One, two. Toss. Grab. Badoosh. Right, so yeah, shove two quick wee beds inside here. Pop that there. And skadoosh. There we are. So now technically we can fit two people in this village. I just need the travels to show up now. <laughs> or do I? No, I definitely do. I definitely do. I technically, I could... Uh, Death Stalker. Uh, technically, I could grab the children. Well, I've got love hearts. I've got the hearts from the other village. I don't know if you can take some of them and technically set up villages over here. I don't know if that's a thing. So that'll be something to try out later on, I suppose. But right, for now, there's the basics. Oh, God, the theme of this village. <laughs> It's going to be pretty crap, but regardless, it will be a village, and uh, yeah, that's, that's all. That's all it will really be. That's all I can really expect it to be at this point. It will be a village. That's that will be that. Also, probably best build some tools because we're going to need them. Um, blah, 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 blah. all right. Well, I'm not going to need them, but the village as well. So yeah, not that. Build an axe. Build a hoe. Shove them in the storage because then they'll pick them up. An enchanted axe, where'd that go? I found an enchanted axe just lying around. Yeah, give them that as well. I'll give them something to do. Right, okay. So put that there. Kill cool, now quickly just hop over here. Yes, I'm pretty much just doing my standard sort of setup that I normally go for whenever I'm kind of standardly setting things up. So, one, two, three, four. Yeah, just cobblestone a thing. We farm, we basic houses, basic village. Basic wee village, which to be fair looks crap on its own, but I, in, I quite like it. In Ruby, obviously I probably would prefer the bigger, fancier village. But, you know, I quite like the cosy wee village and all that jazz. <laughs> make it all nice and small, make it all in together and stuff, you know. It works. Works for me anyway, mainly because I have no skills for building better things. Right, um, the quick thing to do. One, two, three. Want to quickly destroy all these. Which with this shovel is no bother. There we are. Pop that there. Shovel. 
goes the way over to here, and down to there. All right, and pop some cobble here, and then just haul in, put down the, the carrots, because I assume we're going to probably want to put carrots down as well, because carrots are probably the best thing they can eat in the early days. It's now hitting night time. I need it to go daytime. Actually, I can sleep wherever I want. I just realized it doesn't matter, because no matter where I sleep, it never ends up as my bed spawn. Yeah, that's the thing. Uh, yeah, bed spawn doesn't matter anymore because uh, we've ended up with a thing where, because of the, what's it called? In, uh, well, I say rekindle, but that's not it. I don't know why that's not it. Because of the Dark Souls mod, basically. Uh, yeah, whenever you die, you end up over there. So it doesn't really matter where you sleep because you're going to end up back there anyway when you die. So, yeah. Sorry, it doesn't matter, right? I, uh, go down for the night. Um, pop these here as well really quick. Keep the place nice and lit up a bit. I mean, mods are still going to spawn, but regardless. Regardless, we'll find, we'll find with it for the nows. Until the Death Stalker comes over. I'm not going to be fine with that at any point. Actually, no, I say that. I actually, I feel like I'm kitted out to fight a Death Stalker in this world. I think I'll be fine. Right, put that away, put that away, put that away. Grab. Three wool. Badoosh. Let's make a wee basic bed for me. I guess I'll just pop this out here for now. <laughs> Should probably build a house over here and store my things in. Since I'm technically going to be the one running this place. There we are. Right, now that it's this time of day. Um, possibility of nomad spot. Oh. oh, yeah, should probably also plant the things down. Uh, but yeah, possibility of nomad spawning. That's a thing. I saying nomads. Are they nomads? The travelers. Where they are they? Is it nomads? No. I keep saying that. I don't know why. I don't know why. <laughs> Just the word that pops into my brain. Also, this isn't going to be enough carrots, but that's fine. Right, so... Where's the barrier for this place? It's way over here. Okay, that's pretty far. Aha! Found you! Found you, found you, found you! Merchants! Off you go, off you go, mate. Uh, you there! Become my farmer! Why won't you become my farmer? Is it because you're not in the village yet? <gasps> He's gone! Wait, why is he gone? Why is it gone? What? That's not fair. I found them. Oh. I found them and they didn't even bother coming over. Alright, so the buyer ends up over here as well. Where is it exactly? Come on, come on, where are you? Where's the barrier? I know I've gone past it. What's this? That's ah, nothing. Or is it a bit fuller in? No, no, it's not. All right, I don't know where the barrier is. The barrier is somewhere near there. That's fine. Potatoes. And what about the barrier over here? Where's it got to? Oh, there it is. Do 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 do. Aye, there it is. All right, so it goes to over here. Right. This mountain technically counts a little. Just a little, though. Cows. All right, that tells me what I need to know. Sort of. So we've got this big chunk of land over here to play with, too, then. What the glacier in it? Seems to be. Unless I just went through it there. Um. Ow. Seriously. Seriously, we're going to play this game. We're going to play this game. I'm going to freeze you solid. Die. I do dislike you. Right, anyway, uh, where's... I feel like I've gone past the barrier at this point. Right, I'm going back. I'm going back. I want to fight with those things. That's just a pain. Well, I didn't even see where the barrier was. I thought maybe part of the glacier might be counted, but I think it's just before it then. Or it's on line with it or something. Where is it? Generally, you see it. Or not then, whatever. Okay, whatever. It goes to somewhere over there. I'm actually struggling to see where the barrier is in this place. Uh, here we go. Right, okay, I'm gonna fight that. 
It's not a mutated one. You lot. Could have sworn. You didn't exist anymore. Could have sworn I got rid of you lot. Because uh, I did. I got, specifically got rid of them. Why are they spawning? They're not meant to be spawning. <laughs> That's quite weird. Annoying. Like, they're not meant to spawn because they kill, they kill villagers, I'm pretty sure. They go for the villagers. Specifically why we didn't want them spawning because they're a pain in the backside. Hmm. That is quite odd. Right, so I'm not getting a merchant that today then because it just, for some reason, dissolved into nothingness. Over in this corner here. Or is it because they couldn't, like, figure out a path over? Like... Did they, they spawn over here, then. This is one of the places they can spawn. It's, like, right here. This sweet corner here. So in that case, let's just make it a nice wee, nicer path for them, then, I suppose. Yeah, just... uh, actually, a better path would be making an actual path, but never mind. Wait, where's the barrier? Why is the barrier vanished? What? I thought the barrier was constantly on show. What's going on? Or is that part of the issue here? Of why the people disappears because it's... Like what? Oh, I'm quite confused. Why is the barrier fading out of existence? Aha! People! Yeah, there we go! That'll work. Huzzah! You can become that. You can become that. There we are. That'll do. You're a farmer. You're a lumberjack. Although you would rather be a bard, but I don't care. And you have. Uh, does that mean you want to be a cook? I don't, they are called nomads. I was right. I thought I was wrong, but I was right. Right. Um, in that case, though, I now have 47 emeralds to play with. I can now quickly grab some more things. But I'm not going to do that right now. I think I'll do that off camera. Right, so we're gonna, yeah, pretty much change of plans. We're gonna, we're gonna try and um, thingy. So up in our little village, using some of the funds from the other village, because that other village is in tatters, and it seems to be a case with this mod, whenever the people die, they don't, you don't, like, the prices don't go down. It just, the prices keep going up and up and up. Are you hungry? Oh god. Um, I didn't bring any food for yours. Kind of hoping... You would just, you know, do your job and get some food. I suppose it's not growing yet, though. Alright, I'll share some potatoes with you this once. But, I, um, yeah. Anyway. Uh, thing is... For whatever reason, whenever you use, like, stuff to create people over there and create buildings, even if the things go missing or disappear or die, in which case they're gone forever, then you see the prices don't get in. They keep going up still. So, at that point now in that village there, they've lost a lot of the very, kind of, needed things like the clerics the druids teachers and stuff like that. they've lost all them uh, but it still costs enough fortune to replace them so I'm, I'm at the point now where i'm thinking it's probably better just to build a second village use funds in that village to fund this village and try and make this village better in a sense so yeah we'll see how that goes we'll see how that goes we'll just sponge off the leverage a little bit <laughs> whatever i can it's sort of maybe functioning right now. it's sort of functioning so it should be fine Wait, are you still asking for food why you want carrots? Why do you want carrots? That's not a carrot. Is it because you want to replace the carrots in this field? Is that it? I will give you a carrot, but is it, it's because you want to replace them, isn't it? It starts because there's carrots missing in that field that wants to fill up the field. Which, I don't want it to do. Well, I do want it to do, but still. Um... I can't tell it to not replant it, though. It needs to do those things. <laughs> it's just it's took that as the priority over everything. They can actually, oh, that's because it's got nothing else to do. That's why. Oh, yeah, because there's nothing to do here for it right now. So it's like, oh, I've got nothing to do then. So I'll just... I'll just replant the carrots. But you can't replant the carrots because there's no carrots to replant. Right, whatever. Anyway, for today. For today. I think I'll end things there. So we've purged the old village. Although I'd like, I would let it throw out there, even though we've purged it. The uh, nitwits seem to keep re-arriving. There seems to be something going on where they're constantly getting new folk, even when you kill them off. I, I don't know why that is. I find it quite odd. Uh, but yeah, if we go back there right now, back home, 
Sure enough, sure enough, sure enough. There's going to be nitwits floating around. Yeah, that employer back. I killed all you, but you're back again. Eating all the foods. And they won't leave. It just every time I kill uh, every time I kill them, like five more reappear every day. <laughs> it's quite odd. It's like they're just they're coming out of the woodwork like like I don't even know, like cockroaches. It's, they're just they really refuse to die. But they've all got their complaints, they're all up at the, the main bit, they're like, Hey, we need food. There, oh dear. See, if the farmers did their job, this wouldn't be a big deal. Well, the happiness has not up a bit, though. Me killing all the old folk did have a bit of an impact in the village, at least. So the happiness went up ever so slightly. Right, anyway, regardless, for today, I'm going to end this video here. Thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the show. See you on next time for my Anime Warfare, where I may do I may do a quick a wee rejig of the mod pack. I may change some mods about, so that might be a thing in the future. I mean, I'll say in here if I do, so that'll be a thing. But right. If I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. We'll, we'll, we'll send But anyway, see you all then for that. Thank you all for watching. Go bye, everybody.